hello and welcome to this Autodesk Revit tutorial and in today's video I'm going to show you how to cut the wall with the door and the windows now you notice that in Autodesk Revit sometimes you can actually go and include a door and a window but it doesn't even show you if there is a wall there sometimes this error happens and there's a quick way to actually fix it I'm currently on Revit 2025 but what I'm about to show you works on any version of Revit so pay attention for more Revit tips like this, do well to subscribe to the channel. So what you want to do is on the floor plan where you are, I'm currently on level one architectural floor plan. So you notice that I have a door here, but I also have a window, but you can't see the window. If I go through and select another door and go about applying that door, you see that the door is there, but it doesn't actually cut through the wall, which is not very nice if you're trying to present the floor plan. So in order to fix this, all you have to do is um, click an empty space or you can click modify. Make sure that the properties panel is showing you the floor plan properties. So you want to scroll down to where it shows underlay. Okay, no, not underlay. You're going to scroll down to extent. So it's like a view extent. So you're going to head over to view range and click edit. And under the view range, you can see there is a top level, a cut plane and a bottom plane. So what you want to do is go ahead and click show. And this is going to tell you where the cut plane is. So you can see what number two is. Number two is where the cut plane is going to be. And that offset is currently set to 2600 millimeters. Depending on the units that you're using, you can actually pay attention to this value and go ahead and change it. So you can see that the top of the building is at 3000 millimeters, which is three meters in the metric system. You can see the bottom offset is set to zero zero, so it's right on the floor. So if you want to make your windows visible, you want to set this offset to a value that is under the height of the door. So currently, let's pay attention to this. It's 2600. We're going to go ahead and click OK. Now I'm going to select one of my doors. My door has a door height of 2000 millimeters. So the cut plane is not actually showing my door. So all I have to do is change the cut plane to a value lower than 2000 millimeters. Go over to view range, click edit. Remember the value is 2000. So I'm going to choose 1700 as the cut plane offset and then click apply. Once we do that, you can see the door is now visible. Now this is how you can go about showing the cut of the door on the wall. Now notice that this also makes our window visible. So, so that's how you can go about making that cut visible. Go ahead and try this. Let me know how it works out for you. So if you found this video useful, do leave a like on it and also share it with somebody who might be experiencing the same problem. For more Autodesk Revit tutorials, remember to subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video.